Hello and welcome to this episode of Have You Seen? Today we are talking about the instant classic. <laughs> Have you seen Cocaine Bear? Yes, we saw it yesterday. And your thoughts? Uh, it is an instant classic. I think anyone can watch this film. Well, maybe, maybe, maybe not, not maybe children. Not, children yeah. <laughs> not a good idea if children watch this film. Um, there is one thing I would say. The trailer is better than the film. Mm. Which normally happens with most films. Trailers, you know, make up. Yeah. 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 Right. So, if you've not seen Cocaine Bear, I will tell you the story of Cocaine Bear. I like saying Cocaine Bear. <laughs> and they say it in the film, which I liked. Yeah, good. And, like, it was like they were looking for a way to put it in, but... The way they did it was quite good. Yeah. Okay, so the story is based on a true story. So it's partly based on a true story. In 1985, there was a drug smuggler, and he was smuggling his drugs from his plane, and he threw out all the cocaine into the forest where the drug sellers would pick up the drugs and sell them in America. Something happened. He fell to his death, and a bear acts came across the drugs and ate them. And in real life, the bear ate them and died quite quickly. The actual bear is stuffed in America somewhere and you can go look at it. Oh, really? Yeah. Really. No, 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 don't eat that, don't eat that. Let's see what kind of effect that has on uh, But with this, they decided to make it out. What if the cocaine made the bear go on a rampage? <gasps> we have such good luck in nature. <laughs> And that is basically the premise of the film. It's basically it. So <laughs> you've got the um, drug smugglers or the drug sellers trying to find all the cocaine, but the bear's obviously going around. And then you've got a couple of kids who want to do some stuff, meet up with the bear. You've got the park ranger and her love interest, I guess. Yeah, he's a wildlife like mapper. I think he's mapping the wildlife yeah, in yeah. the park. And they all run into the bear, who is after the cocaine and will do whatever it can to get more cocaine. I liked the a diverse amount of characters that they had. They had, like, loads of different characters um, all, like, thrown together in strange ways, which, yeah. is, which made it interesting, more interesting than I thought it was going to be. A, an oddball group, as they would say. Yeah. Um, did you enjoy Cocaine Bear? I did enjoy Cocaine Bear. Some good news for you people out there. It's a tight 90. Yes. It's not long. It's... it was not too long. It was not drawn out. The action happened and then more action happened. And then I was thinking towards the end, how are they going to wrap it up? Well, the bear. Obviously, they wrapped it up with the mostly everyone dying, yeah. which was good as well. The bad people. They weren't afraid to take risks with people dying. No, no, not at all. Um, I, I, uh, there was lots of different scenes that I enjoyed. Uh, the best one is in the trailer. Um, it's the, I think he's a he's a gentleman from uh, TikTok, but I don't have TikTok, so uh, he does YouTube shorts about working. He plays the ambulance. Man and the bear come. Well, the bear's in there and he opens the door. He gets attacked, and it's it's, it's a good scene. It's a good scene. I enjoyed that one. Beth, we should go. Who was your best or favourite character? I thought you well the bear. Yeah, mine would be the bear cubs. The bear cubs were great. When you see the bear cubs and they're all covered in cocaine <laughs> and they're just looking for cocaine, it's quite funny. Uh, obviously, don't do drugs. They're bad for you. It was a bear. A bear? It was far. Hey, that's inappropriate. And I think this film illustrates that. Yeah. Uh, don't do drugs or you could run into a bear and die. Yeah, pretty much. Well, this film was directed by Elizabeth Banks, who... Best known as an actor, but has also now gone into directing. And I think she did quite well. Yeah, I I think that she did well to sort of make it exciting enough. Yeah. The um, action was on point. Yeah. Quick. There was no, like, waiting around. Well, at, at the start, it was a little bit slow. You just want... At the very start, it starts with a bear attacking a couple. 
but then it's kind of like building to, and you, I was kind of like waiting, like when's a bear going to come? Mm. When, when they had to do a tiny bit of setup. Yeah, which is fair enough. Did you hear there could be sequels? Cocaine Shark. <laughs> so again, I'm guessing smugglers and cocaine in the water. But I don't understand how. Well, it'd just be like Jaws. Yeah. You know, water. Except. Yeah. If you've got any ideas of. Other movies that you'd like to see where animals take drugs and go on a rampage, <laughs> write in the comment section down below. Alligator or meth? Mm. That could be a new Jurassic Park film. <laughs> yeah. Rabbits on weed. Jurassic World. <laughs> Cocaine T-Rex. That it seems like the thing that stays with the man forever. <laughs> Make sure you check out Cocaine Bear. It's in your theatres now. I think. Yes, now. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe so we can do more of these things because, you know, we need to pay to go to the cinema. And if you subscribe, then we can. It make us know that what we're doing is helping you and you're having an enjoyable time. So, and you will have an enjoyable time at Cocaine Bear. Yeah. You just will. Indeed. Indeed. Thanks for watching. Until next time, see you later. Goodbye. <laughs>